everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing on Saturday afternoon, January the 14th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle East Coast Racing Report. Let's go to the Big A this afternoon, folks, for one of two stake races on their card, race 3, 121 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Shots of Ringing Stakes, 8.3 furlongs, that's a mile and 70 yards, an Aqueduct's winterized inner dirt track. Four-year-olds and up racing for a stakes prize of some $75,000. Contenders number three, Sam Pablo. Number six, Social Saul. Number five, Sam Sparkle. And number four, isn't he perfect? Number three, Sam Pablo has won four of six in his career to date. Racing at or about today's distance of a mile and 70 yards on the dirt is both the overall speed and pace profile leader. Has hit the board in five straight, winning four including back-to-back -back power run wins in his last two starts. Jockey Cornelio Velasquez and trainer Todd Pletcher sent him to the post. They've hit the board with 60% of their entry saddled as a team to date. Number six, Social Saul has produced power run performances in five straight, hitting the board in three of those adventures. Race three summary, number three, San Pablo tops my contenders list, which also includes number six, Social Saul, number five, Sam Sparkle, and number four, Isn't He Perfect? Three, six, five, four, and the third from Aqueduct, the $75,000 shots are ringing stakes. Let's go to Gulfstream Park next for race nine, 417 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Hal's Hope Stakes, a mile test on the dirt. Grade three, four-year-olds and up racing for $100,000. Contenders number one, Jackson Bend. Number four, Successful Mission. Number seven, Soaring Empire. And number three, Sangari. Number one, Jackson Bend has hit the board in power run fashion in each of his last five, including back-to-back -back power run wins in his third and fourth races back. Number four, Successful Mission, the pace profile leader in the stakes field. Racing at today's distance of a mile on the dirt has posted a trio of wins in his last four, including back-to-back -back power run wins in his last two outings. I downgraded this entry a notch on my contenders list since that last race was some 237 days ago. Race 9 summary, number 1, Jackson Ben tops my contenders list, which also includes number 4, Successful Mission, number 7, Soaring Empire, and number 3, Sangaree, 1, 4, 7, 3 in the ninth today from Gulfstream Park, the $100,000, Grade 3, Hal's Hope Stakes. Bonus long shots on Saturday, Beulah Park, race 3, entry number 3, Suzette's Honor of 15 to 1 bomb, the overall speed leader in this allowance field, sprinting at 6 furlongs on the dirt. Charlestown, race 2, entry number 8, Couvie Avenue, a 5 to 1 shot, qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony, is the overall speed leader in this maiden field, sprinting at or about tonight's distance of 4 and 1 half furlongs on the dirt. So handicapping from both the Big A, Aqueduct, and Gulfstream Park on a Saturday afternoon. Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.